Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel and welcome to the first episode, I guess, in a series of vlogs that I know that you guys will all be looking forward to watching because I am currently, whoop, guess where I am? You know where I am from that view. I'm currently at Alphic Event Ponies HQ and Maggie and I are heading off to a very fun and exciting location to do our annual, I say annual because it happened last year, hopefully it'll happen again in the future too, but our annual badminton training prep. Now I know that everybody enjoyed coming along with us for our training and prep last year at Lucinda's. Sadly, we're not heading there again today, but we are all loaded up. God, I'm not actually gonna show in there. It's, I've had two days here first, so it's a little bit less organized than it was when I left Cornwall. However, we have done a bit of tack cleaning this morning, getting everything ready to get on the road. And we are heading to a familiar location that you will have seen in vlogs before, but not for a few years. So I'm gonna leave that with you whilst we get on the road. Bank is already on board. Meg is just about to load Jamalam up. And yeah, then we will be heading off. It's a couple hours drive. And when we get there, I'm sure, or I'm hoping we can uh, spot a few familiar faces so that you will remember what it was that we did there the very first time we attended a few years ago. And yeah, get some epic content for you guys to enjoy and some much needed training in ahead of badminton, which is coming round rather rapidly now. So yes, you may recognize this familiar stable. Do you recognize this familiar face? Hello, beautiful. You're so pretty. This familiar arena. And this familiar face. Hello. Oh, it's been nearly three years since I was last here. I know, it's been, I cannot believe we've, Time. Known, each, we've known each other that long. Oh, I know. That's great, isn't it? What a wonderful. We've had a lot of fun along the way. Wonderful three years we've had. We certainly have. But yeah, time certainly flies while you're having fun because it doesn't seem that long to be honest, does no, it? No, it really doesn't. Really, you can't. How's Jam Bam? Mm -hmm. She's good. I mean, you've been a very busy boy in here. He has. He said he was building a course. Didn't realise it'd be that long and big and, yes. well, not big, but you know what I mean. Uh, okay. well, yeah. Uh, yeah, but it's not. We're not. We're not going to use it all now. But I kind of. I'm teaching all after all afternoon tomorrow, so I need. Yes. All our, all the, everything kind of out. And ah. We don't have to use. So all yes, of it. we are at Field Farm for a fun few days of training with Simon. Fun training. Yay. Yay! Fun time training. It's going to be educational, informative, but most of all fun. Hey, Simon. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Hopefully. 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 Oh, so first up, we are doing show jumping. We've not long arrived, to be honest, so it's a little bit of a quick get on and go for Meg and Jam. Thanks is chilling in the stable for a minute. And then after their session, it will be our turn. So I won't actually waffle on for too long because I know the majority of you are here for the training when you're watching videos like this. And obviously, Meg and Simon are going to be mic'd up and filmed by Pete, so. It is a cool place, that's why we were so willing to drive so far to come to you. <laughs> well, yeah, not so bad for you. And not so bad for me when I get to stop off the night at yours, or two nights, I should add. We've had a lovely two days so far, and we're excited for another two stroke three days of playing ponios. And yeah, obviously everything Jam Bam related will be on Meg's channel. But Pete's just run to get another camera. Yes, he's got to get a camera for you to use, darling. Ah, a camera like this? You didn't think you were going to relax? No, of course not. Oh, the slow-mo one. Nice slow-mo camera. Amazing. Just talk to me about um, more recent, like the last six months. 
What have you, what, what have we been up to? The last six months have been pretty good, actually. I feel like I've kept on top of things over winter this year, which I've previously been guilty of not. Yeah. Um, been... I haven't been competing enough, probably. I've been consistently training. Yeah. But not been competing enough. Which yeah. Isn't quite. But then, you know, we have to travel so far to compete, don't we? So. Yeah, and that's it. And train. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, but, yeah, no, all feeling good. Just... I feel like I give him mixed signals sometimes. So, you know, he's willing, he wants to do everything. Yes. He wants to do it at a higher speed generally than he should most of the time. He does. He does. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but he's had some good training recently. He spent a week at Alex's and had to knuckle down and work hard. Yeah. And now I and need did... to keep on top of the discipline. And so, and your regular training. Mm hmm. Who do you have your regular training with? Well, that's the trouble. I don't really because, yeah, because there's nobody in Cornwall. Yeah. So you have to travel. Because you had that. There was that chap that you were going. Who was in Cornwall? John. Yeah, he's away doing the Sunshine Tour for twelve uh, weeks. Okay. <laughs> oh, that's so I know nice. that was literally like twenty minute drive, so that worked mm. quite well. And obviously, I go. Because I remember watching you put video of you and him up jumping and. And the energy in the canter was so good, but you weren't hooting around 100 miles an hour at the same time. It was, it was just, it was just right. <laughs> oh, good. And um, and and I remember thinking, oh, that, that looked. Oh, and that was at his. And that was at his, yeah, yeah, oh, okay. yeah. Because yeah. I think I messaged you. Yeah, I think, I think I you did you. actually. Yeah. Um, and um, yeah, okay. Oh, so that's frustrating. Um, it is. So, but then what he'll did be back, Al he'll be back in a few weeks? So for the BE season, like in the There's, middle of the season, that works but, well. Yeah. They're, they're and what there. did Alex say, having ridden him a fair bit and jumped him and stuff? Yeah. What did he say? He says he's really cool and really fun, but he, I just need to be more disciplined. He yeah. said for the first like day or two, he came out and was like, I need 20, 30 minutes of being what I want to be like until I knuckle down and work. Right, and he okay. said, I don't have time for that, Banksy. I've got 10 more horses to ride. You need to knuckle down straight away. Yeah. And he said, you're just soft on him. And I'm like, yeah, I know, but he's my baby. Yeah, yeah. Well, that's <laughs> and that's understandable. Yeah, but it's 10 years of softness. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, because I, I, don't, I don't want to be saying anything today, tomorrow, or the next day that's going to be going completely against no, what, you, what you've been doing. So we'll, we'll work together a little bit here rather than... The yeah. thing is, although he does always, he's keen and enthusiastic, I do still need to ride him forwards, otherwise we get the chip-ins. Yes. If I make him wait, because he has got quite a short stride, mm -hmm. so I still, I need his canter to be big, but not fast, don't I? Yeah, yeah. Yes, absolutely. And I'm guilty of when it goes faster, I take my leg off and pull. Yeah. And then we get into a bit of a disunited flap. Yeah. So cool, isn't he? He's like, <laughs> hi, Simon. I haven't seen you for ages. He's no. a human, actually. Sat on me yet, Simon. I haven't seen you for ages. No. Maybe you should have done this session, and then you'd know what you're dealing with. <laughs> Definitely not. It's all about. It's all about you. It's all about oh, yeah. you. I was like, we, ha we do travel this far. We do need to actually ride our own horses. Absolutely. <laughs> Right, OK, so when you're ready, let's pick up a uh, trot on the left, Ren. We'll go large, because you've not actually had a trot round yet, have you? No. So just getting him used to his environment, because it is quite spooky in here. That corner especially, well, those two corners, actually, are he, particularly... He's already feeling remarkably, remarkably better than the last time he came in here. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sorry, you said go large, didn't you? Oops. That's all right. We'll do a change and then... Remember that first time he came in here and he wouldn't go near any of the fillers? Cam had to lead me. Just come this oh my much God. the story of my life in new venues, having to be led. <laughs> <laughs> Tina's doing the lead rain class. <laughs> <laughs> oh, is it, the, is it the wheel? I think it's the uh, wheel. We can jump that uh, later. <laughs> yeah. Can I come through again? Yeah, I think so. Oh my gosh, that face. And then I would just walk in alongside the banner. And straight away, Tina, I want you to be thinking about bend and flexion through that turn there. And then yeah, let's work. I should work. have predicted that was going to happen, shouldn't I? <laughs> work a little bit with the gears. So move the trot forward and back on, that, on those long sides. And then collect as much as you can on the short side there. But making sure that you're going to, you're, with the hand, you're going to the bit, not your hand coming a little bit backward there, okay. yeah? And then a bit of medium trot down this long side, rhythm of that. Good girl, then straight back to that rhythm again. He says, this is very exciting being here. <laughs> yeah. Well, he and then collect as much the as, And then collect as much as you can on that short side, that's it, just like that. 
good boy. And then medium again, contact for hand, foot, hand forward. That's it, good boy, and then back again. Just making sure, Tina, that you don't go to your inside rein for control, and, and sometimes there I feel like we've just got a little bit too much inside rein there, okay. yeah? So soft with the inside rein, riding from that inside rein into that outside hand, and then medium trot down this side as well. Uh -uh. Rhythm, that's plenty. Good girl. And we need to do that again, see if we can keep them that little bit softer. Good boy. Good girl, that's it. And then forward. Good boy. Softly, that's plenty. And then back, good girl, well done. And then we'll do it down the next long side again. Yeah. And just balance in the middle, subtly balance in the middle and then go again. So we're coming out of this corner into a bit of medium trot, then balance halfway and then go again. So softly forward and that into that medium. Good boy. And then back again and then forward again. But it's making sure you're keeping him nice and straight within that, yeah? Good boy. Good girl, well done. This time a little bit of shoulder in down the next long side. Good girl, outside rein. Inside leg into the outside hand, not too much neck bend. Remember you're bringing your shoulders off the track. That's it, better. Good girl. Good boy. So better second half there, yeah? yeah? Let's do that down the next long side. Again, thinking about the energy of that trot, but rhythm as well. Outside rein, bring them sh those shoulders off the track. Good girl. Uh, uh, Not uh, too much neck bend. Shoulders back. Good boy. Good girl, shoulders back, eyes up. Mine. <laughs> That's it, well done. And then this time, Tina, we're going to introduce a little bit of medium trot within the shoulder in. Really? Very subtly, yeah? <laughs> Very subtly. Outside rein, that's it. Good boy, that's plenty, that's plenty. <laughs> he does really try, bless him. Very good, good lad. Let's do a half circle, trot through my whiteboards and then turn left afterwards and we'll change the rein. Trot through your whiteboards? Yeah. <laughs> oh, good. Good girl, then turn <laughs> left. Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> and then we're going to do our medium trots on this rein, yeah? So okay. medium down that long side, medium down this long side. Not too much neck uh, rain. Uh, uh. And then your medium. Doesn't need to be crazy. Rhythm, balance, keeping him soft. Left flexion. So that's where the shoulder fall, shoulder in really helps, yeah? That's it, don't make a deal about the, those corners. <laughs> Why do they look so different this way? I know, they're terrifying though, they're terrifying. <laughs> And then medium again, soft in your arm, relaxed. Thumbs on top, bending that elbow so you're really soft through that arm. That's better, good girl. Bring him back, think shoulder in, yep. so you've got him a little bit more where you want him for when he comes to his spooky part. But make sure there, Tina, that you're not neck reining with that inside rein to get that inside bend, yeah? Needs to come from that left leg. So bringing him back, shoulder in. Inside bend, good girl, keep that left good leg boy. there. Well done, left shoulder back, sit up tall, strong in, your, strong, strong in those tummy muscles. Good girl, and then a shoulder in down this long side. Good boy. Good boy. That's it, well done. It's very difficult doing it down all that, all that way. Yeah. It's a long way down that arena. <laughs> so let's come and do that again. So bringing those shoulders off the track. Uh, 
Outside rein, that's it, good girl. Keep that left leg there, a little bit more. Good girl. So that's something that definitely needs working on, Tina, yeah? Yeah. So you've got that shoulder in as a little bit more of a tool. Shoulder yeah. in again down this, down this long side. See if you can get a little bit more angle this time. Keep those fingers closed around that outside rein. That's it, well done. Have that little discussion, good boy. That's it there. Good boy. Good, good boy. Okay, half circle through my white boards and then we're gonna go onto a figure of eight through the white boards. And then straight away, we're gonna introduce a little bit of medium shot on either side. Good boy. Good boy. And making sure that he doesn't motorbike around those corners, yeah? Yeah. Making sure that you balance him, you're thinking about the positioning, thinking about using that little bit of shoulder for shoulder in feeling as you're approaching the turn to make sure he is where you want him to be. Into the outside rein, inside leg into outside hand. Balance. Oh. <laughs> boy. Prepare, that's it. That's the nice then. <laughs> it's okay, don't worry. And then that little bit of medium trot. Oh. <laughs> and that's where you just need to make sure that you're in balance, yeah? Yeah. And take your time. And the same with these boards, yeah? Take your time, balance them on the approach. Little half halt. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Very good there, yeah? He really thought about what he was doing that yeah, time, he yeah? Did, didn't he? And then softly, uh, just a couple of steps of me, that's it, plenty, Good and boy. then back again. Keeping <laughs> it so it's nice and relaxed. He says, that's hard work. Keeping it nice and relaxed, rhythmical. Good boy, Good then boy. round to the left. Excellent, well done, Tina. And then those medium trot steps, soft in those wrists. That's it. And then this time we're going to go through the white boards and then we're going to turn right and pick up right canter. Ooh. I feel Rhythm. like he heard you say that. Rhythm. He says, are we cantering now? Good boy. Just normal canter there, working canter around there, then back to trot by the green roll top there, then to the, with your trot boards again and then turn left and then we'll do that on the left rein as well. Now thinking about those upward and downward transitions, trying to keep them round and soft, but making sure that he keeps that pole up. Good boy, very clever there, good lad. And canter left. Good girl, well done. Get your back down. <laughs> this is, do, we, do we need to go large and have a little canter off, this, off the saddle for a minute? Yeah. I think we do. Well, maybe not. <laughs> Stop. Thank you. Doesn't mean you can't still bend. Good boy. One more circuit. So we can just get that the energy out of him. Says, I'm very excited to be here, Simon. Yeah. Good boy. That's it. Well done. And then we'll keep the canter, then back to our exercise. So forward to trot, and then round up, up to your up white boards again. Forward to trot, outside rein. And then this time, we'll do the same thing again, actually. See how, see whether he's just a little bit less excitable. Good boy. And then pick up right canter. Just make sure, team, when you're asking those transitions, there's plenty of preparation there, yeah? Yeah. So as you're coming through those white boards, thinking about doing those couple of steps of sitting trot, pole up. Outside shoulder, make sure he's bending around that inside leg. Good boy. Now thinking about your transition now, so sitting <laughs> and canter. Good, Good boy. boy. Well done. Rhythm of canter, keeping it level. Good girl, lovely there. But then he slightly fell into that downward yeah, transition, yeah? 
And then round to the right. This time we're going to introduce. Nice. This time <laughs> we're going to. Don't worry. Eyes up, eyes up. This time we're going to introduce that little bit of medium canters. Just two or three steps of medium. Again, not too much inside rain there. So I want you to be really organised about these transitions, yeah? Good boy. Good boy. And then forward to canter left. Good girl. And then a transition to medium. Four or five steps. Good girl. And then outside rain, bringing him back. Then hold up, hold up. So there again, he fell into that transition. You did a really good job of bringing him back and then he fell into that trot transition. So just ask him to wait for just that split second longer this time. Good boy. Good boy. And then your medium steps. And then back again, but keeping him up, keeping that pole up. And then forward into that downward transition. Good boy. Good boy, good lovely boy. there, good lad. Off that left leg, very good. And then that little bit of medium canter again. And then outside rain, bringing him back. Pole up, pole up, pole up. Good, good boy. better. Well done. Yeah, I can feel that felt better. Once more off the right rein, see if we can do exactly the same thing. <laughs> oh, good boy. Good chap. Pole up again. Contact though, then bring him back, sitting up, pole up, pole up, pole up. Good boy. Good. Not quite as good as on the left. No. But that was still better than it was last time. Very good, good from him there. And there, just work the neck a little bit. He just fell onto the left shoulder there, yeah? So just get him off that left leg. I think that's it, think a little bit shoulder in. And before you do a walk transition, we'll give him a break for a minute. So I do think that that sh shoulder in is actually a really important thing for him. Oh. I think we, it's something that you could make quite a lot of use of. And, and at, yeah, the moment, at the moment, you're struggling with it a little yeah. bit. Yeah. <laughs> it ends up being a little bit too much neck bend. Or, Especially on the left range, and it's not strong enough on my left leg. And it's quite sporadic yeah. um, in, the, in the angle and the bend and all that mm. kind of stuff. And it's just something that's really worth working on. And I know, like, you know, you can do it on the road when you're hacking out, yeah. you know, and, and just and really focus on getting it so that you're basically closing the door with the outside rein so that he can't go, he, so that he brings the shoulder across. Yeah. Yeah. Um, you're <laughs> such a good boy, aren't you? Isn't that fun? Thank you. But what I, what I also really like, though, is like, he's like, yeah, yeah, I'm really excited. And then you just do two circuits of canter. He's like, oh, I'm okay now. <laughs> I, can, I can focus again now. Yeah. Which is just, which is so <laughs> lovely. <laughs> Good boy. He's no, just a, I, yeah. I mean, he's just a lovely person, isn't he, really? Yeah. I always think he's a bit like a Springer Spaniel. Oh my, yeah, he just, he just wants- loves life. He wants to please, but just every so often he's like, I'm just so overcome with excitement. <laughs> if you feel like you need to, come and trot the first time. Okay. I just don't want him to turn around and tank at it. So all the more reason to maybe come and trot the first time. Yeah. Just be prepared, he might make a bit of a muddle of it, but that's fine, yeah? A muddle. That's, that's his problem. Soft arm. Good girl, good turn boy. left. Good boy. I, I, I get your back down. We're very, very fresh, aren't we? Oh, oh, my God, was he like wild? Good girl. Now we've got to keep going, staying in that same rhythm. Outside rain to control that pace. Good girl, well done, keep going. He'll get bored in a minute. Yeah, no, it's fine. Just keep going with that, Tina, until he just has a, uh, just has a word with himself. Don't. I'm not letting you. Good girl, that's it, well done. And then thinking bend, outside rain to control that pace again. Good girl. In, keep that inside bend, don't let him fall onto that inside shoulder. Good girl, well done. <laughs> keep going. And the same this way. So last time on this rain, he fell onto the right shoulder, didn't he? Yeah. So think a little bit more inside bend here. Keeping that pole up, keep the same level rhythm of flow of canter, that's it. Good girl, well done, and again. 
Sorry, Tina. We're going to just keep going until he just settles a little bit. Yeah, that's fine. Get your head up. Good, <laughs> good girl. Well done. So we want to think Do about the quality, the quality of the canter step here, yeah? So we've got energy so that he does make up that distance. Pole up. Good girl. Good boy. Bit better. Once more off this range. Do I need range. longer range, Simon? Or... You are sorry? Do I need longer range? No. Just need just, his head up. Just guide, guiding that pole up. Guide that pole up and then soften. Good boy. Good girl. Have a breather for a minute. So he's very excited, <laughs> which, which is fine. Yeah. But we just need to get, when, when he get, does get excited, he drops behind the contact a little bit, puts his head, tucks his head in, drops his head, drops his, drops his ears and yeah. just goes behind the That's what I was like, do I and, need longer range? And that, the thing is, the longer I made them, in fact, they're like... No, I, I, no I, I don't think so. I think, what you, I think what you need to do is guiding him up. So, so guide up and soften, guide up and soften, not and, holding him up And there. more leg, even though he's feeling keen. Exactly, yeah, yeah, which is easier said than done, yeah. I know. <laughs> Good boy, well done, mate. Right. It we... felt like he was, because I was then trying to make him wait a bit, he was finding that a bit long, wasn't he? Yes, yeah, yeah. And that's where we've got to get the happy balance with you having the control and the rideability, uh -huh. but with a little bit more step. Somebody needs to remind me 17. <laughs> God, is he really 17? Yeah. Bless him. Right, let's have a little canter down, all four. <laughs> so the two bounces. Watch yourself, Pete. <laughs> And am I, am I meant to be riding a certain amount of strides in the middle or just staying No, straight? you're gonna you're just gonna ride what you've got, yeah? Okay. There is a bit of a distance down there, but I want you to ride the canter that you've got rather than thinking about that, yeah? Head up. That's it. Head up but soft arm when you've got it there. Good boy. Good girl. A bit better. Right. So I want you to think, Tina, as you're going down this line about being sit, him being straight, you thinking about where your body is and keeping those eyes up. Okay. You're yeah. a bit naughty for looking down. Like when you go through am. that last bounce there, I felt like you were looking down. It looked like you were from the behind anyway. Uh, Good girl. Oh, not very straight on landing. Yeah, exactly. So I want you to think about having a couple more steps straight on landing. Yeah. And as you come round this turn, that he doesn't fall onto the inside Motorbike. shoulder. He's better this way than to the right. <laughs> you... Famous last words. <laughs> Good boy. One, two, three, four. Straight. Good girl. Better. Once more. Pull up. One, oh, sorry. Yeah, sorry, once more. This Never time, think about <laughs> what I want you to do here, Tina. I want you to ride a really square turn, yeah? So, a thinking a little turn. bit more right bend and right flexion here before you come around this corner. Right bend, right flexion, right bend, right flexion, right bend, right bend, right bend, right bend, right bend. So just come come straight round again. I want you to be Should thinking. Should I have carried on from that? Yes, yes. yes. Okay. I, I would have done. Okay. But, um, but you've got to do what you feel most comfortable with. But yeah. when you're coming around this corner, just think a little more. bit more inside bend, a little yeah. more inside flexion, because at the moment he's falling onto that right shoulder quite yeah. a lot. On the left, he wasn't quite as bad, yeah? <laughs> Woo! It doesn't help that he's so Now it's going to be fun. So, so let's go a little square. So turn, turn. No. And then turn again. <laughs> That's it, good girl. And then a proper square here. So tight turn, straight. Tight turn, straight. Tight turn, straight. And then turn again. Good girl, well done, that's it, perfect. And again, off that right, off that right leg. He doesn't want to work hard. Keep on that problem. square, keep on that square, right bend. Good girl, outside lane contro controlling that. Good, that's it, well done. And then turn again. The square's gone a little bit oval-like, yeah? Or it can be a rectangle, but it's got to have square sides. Uh -huh. That's it, good girl. Woohoo! 
Head up. That's it. And then let's come this time. Right bend. Right bend. A good girl. Straight. <laughs> well corrected. Good girl. Could have been a lot straighter there. And you just needed to be a bit more on the ball that time, yeah? Once more off the left rein, and the same thing here, Tina. If he does decide to fall onto the inside shoulder, yep. and he does hook off, straight onto a square. Don't come to it. Good boy. Good girl. Well done. Straight on the getaway. Ah. Good girl. Eyes up. That's it, have a breather for a minute, Tina. Get your head up. <laughs> How did that feel? Better than <laughs> the best yet. Yeah, Be so uh, I thought that the right that time was really good. Yeah, I wasn't quite straight on landing, yeah. but the approach... So we weren't better. straight on the getaway, but the approach is the biggest issue at the minute. Yeah, and true. that was really good, yeah? Uh-huh. Right, Tina, we're going to come from the other end this time. I think he might have actually been better coming all the way from Cornwall and then working, not having two <laughs> days in the stable first. He should have hacked here. <laughs> hacked here, yeah. <laughs> you little cheeky monkey. OK, so we'll come off the left rein first. And if I'm coming off the left rein, does that mean I'm then landing on the right, yeah? Exactly, you've got it. Oh, good. <laughs> But you are, you're naughty for looking down. I know. So it's just something to be aware of all the time. Okay, off you go. Good boy. That's it. Thinking about the rideability, where his body is, inside bend, round that left leg. Hand low, hand low, hand low. Straight. Well, well tried. Right flexion down this long side, and again, the same thing here. If he scoots round this turn, put a square in. Good boy. Good girl. Straight on landing. Oh, good girl, well done. Have a breather again. I almost overshot Oh my God, yeah, no, that was... I wasn't expecting them to... I thought, that, I thought that was loads better. Yeah. Loads better, very good. Uh, right. Sorry, time's flown, has not it? <laughs> Camera. Um, Tina, I want you to also think about when you have seen your fence and you've seen no. your distance. Oh. Some, sometimes you get a little bit uh, like yeah. that in your body. I want you to see if you can get, get it to come from your leg a little Just bit more. Just relax a bit. Yeah? So that you can stay in balance. Uh-huh. Da -da. I'm going to put a little skinny in as well. OK. OK? So it's two and two, Tina. OK. Two and two. And we're going to come from the Andrews Bowen end the first time. Wait, wait, wait. So from that end. On the left or right? On, let's go on the right rein first. <laughs> Listen. Listen to me. Oh, yeah. No. That's it. Have that discussion. If you need to put that square in, do so. Good boy. Not too much inside rain, not too much inside rain. So, on to that square next time, Tina, yeah? Uh, I felt that coming before I even got to the corner. Yeah, so that's where you need to be a bit more like, no, no, we're going to go on the square. And I don't, I don't care what you do, mate, we're going on the square, yeah? yeah? <laughs> it's good that he's feeling so jolly, though. Right flexion, right bend, off that right leg. Good girl, well done, that's it, keep going. 
correct that count, that's it, perfect. Square, remember. Keep on that square, keep on that square. Good girl, well done. Do I need to lean back a bit more? Am I tipping forward? No, you're fine, you're fine as you are. Ride from the outside rein a little bit more, yeah? Outside rein controls the pace and the shoulder. Good girl. Straightness on the getaway, Tina. Steady, balance, take your time. Don't be in a rush. Off that left leg. Stay straight. Good girl, let's come and do that once more. Off Ooh. both reins. Sorry. I want you to try and dictate the rhythm through there a little <laughs> bit more if you can, yeah? So when you're coming right, coming through here, bring your shoulders up, keep your body back. Yeah. Think, make sure that you're sitting in the middle of him. I just celebrated the fact we got a half decent turn and went, go. <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. And that's very much what it looked like. And then that <laughs> interferes with the, because with, the whole point of this really is for him yeah. to take his time and think about what he's doing and use yeah. himself. So again, if you need to put that square in, do so, yeah? Off that right leg. Inside bend, inside. Good girl, well done. And turn again, and straight. And turn, and straight. Keep those shoulders where you want them. Good girl. Good boy, very good. Steady, straight. Good girl, well done, left bend, left flexion. Head up. Good energy, and again off the left brain. Pole up, guide that pole up. Good girl, that's it. There, you're being a bit more effective. Good woman, well done. Now balance, take your time, don't be in a rush. Good boy, super. Good girl. We'll do it once more yeah, off the I left. Yeah, I my leg off completely then. Yeah, once more off the left rein, Tina. Okay. Get your head up. Pole up, pole up, pole up. He says it's because he's a bit fresh, that's all, that's all that is. Right, so there, you did, uh, like, because you got the first run a little bit wrong, yeah. you rather froze, yeah? <laughs> and that's where he needs your support more than anything, yeah? yeah? That's when he really needs you to step up to the market and go, no, no, this is fine. You're, even though you've made a bit of a Horlicks here, I'm still here to support you yeah. and show you. Whereas I felt like you landed over that and were a bit like, <laughs> uh, sorry about that, mate, I screwed it up. Well, actually, you didn't screw it up. It's a, all of this is about teaching him and training him to look after himself. Yeah. Yeah? Okay, once more off the left rein. This one's going to be perfect. This one's going to be absolutely magical. I've, yeah. I've got a feeling. Normally when I say that, it goes horribly wrong. <laughs> I'm joking. I'm not joking. <laughs> off that left leg, left bend, left flexion. Sit still, balance, straight. Oh, good boy. Ah, we were going that way though. <laughs> you come off the left, you finish on the right. Well done. Thank you. Let's do it once more off from the other end. Okay. So we'll come off the left rein first, Tina, I think. Actually, no, stay on the right rein, seeing as you're on the right rein. We're gonna come from Meg, Meg's end. I didn't hear you, where Meg is? We're gonna come from Meg's end down. Off the right or left? Uh, off the thing as you're on the right rein, we'll start on the right rein. Okay. Oh, she's running. Oh my God. So the, he's not going, he's tucking up so much just because he wants to get his own way, isn't he? Oh, totally, yeah. 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 And, uh, but I don't want to make too much of a big thing about it. No. Because I think the, the way I make it, what I'd normally do is work him harder. <laughs> but he's got, he's got a couple of days of really hard days, work. Exactly. So we don't want to do that at the minute. I just, should my hands come higher? So you're guiding and soft, guiding up and soft, okay. yeah? 
just feels so alien because he doesn't normally tuck his head that low. <laughs> yeah. It is an evasion at the end of the day. So thinking about that bend and flexion through the turn, if you need to put that square in, do so. Well done, well done. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Left bend, left flexion again. Balance, sit up, contact. Work the neck a little bit. Sit still, sit still. Once more off the right rein for me, Tina. Off the right, sorry. Yeah, once more off the right rein. And again, try not to panic in the middle and then go heavy in your seat, yeah? Again, thinking bend through this turn, outside rein, control the pace in the shoulder, hand low. Sit still, sit still, sit still. Oh, good boy. Work the neck, square. Pole up. And then give him a big pat, good boy. Good boy. <laughs> that was good. Never a knock his enthusiasm. No, absolutely. Um, but it also it's about you making sure that you have got it. So it was interesting there how, whether it's just the freshness, but he's just diving onto that inside shoulders, particularly okay. on- To the left. But no, particularly on, the, we, right, on yeah. the right rein, yeah? Yeah. Um, which is interesting. Um, but it'd be interesting to see what he's like tomorrow, having had a little bit of work today, <laughs> um, and whether he whether he's still doing the same kind of thing. And we're doing cross country tomorrow morning, so um, yeah. so he can get rid of some of that energy then, can't he? Yes, he can. That was really good. Oh, no, that was good. Thank you. It definitely improved. <laughs> yes. It just. <laughs> but also, it, it's good for you to be able to think about your body position as well. You have to think about so much. And don't thinking you? about that you're square in the saddle and that you're straight in your body and in your. But in your hips and in your shoulders and, and then, because otherwise he's never going to be straight if you're not. And all the way through, not just on the turn. Mm, yeah. <laughs> Good. Thank you. Pleasure, treasure. Good boy. Steaming? It's hard. <laughs> we are steaming. We are steaming. I know, I'll let them in and take him for a walk down the lane outside, I think, because he's... You can, have, you can have a walk around the outdoor if you want oh, to have a walk down yeah, the outdoor. Yeah, he's just rather warm, Because there's lights on out there. Good boy. Thank you. <laughs> All of you. <laughs> oh, yeah. Freshness, hopefully, all out the way. Yeah, I know. Spicy. I know. It's so hard, though. Can we... Sorry, guys. It's such an automatic instinct to take your leg off, isn't it? When they're like that, you need to keep it on. Ta -da. <sighs> well done, Tina. That was very good. Very good. Now that she's gone. <laughs> <laughs> Good. I quite like my little exercise down the middle there. Yeah, I like that. Well done. Yeah, did you enjoy it? Yeah, give us a debrief, Simon, on both our sessions. Um, it's just, it's a really good exercise for just making sure that the girls have got the horses where they need to be. So that is almost a wrap for day one. You're a sweaty boy, though. Look at the steam coming off him still. I'm going to have to wait a little bit longer, then put your dry rug on under your stable rug because I had to give him a nice warm, oh yeah, that's not sweat, that's actually nice warm bath water because he was such a sweaty boy because he worked so hard and wound himself up quite so much, didn't you? But yeah, this is doing its job and drying him off and then we're off to our Airbnb. But yeah, very pleased with that session. It was hard work but I don't know if that's going to balance there but find the same on Meg's channel <laughs> I was like I'm going to balance that there is Pete going to tell me off look would you be in trouble for that no to be fair Pete doesn't really care about these cameras <laughs> they're not good enough for him <laughs> a bit rude I mean there's rubber matting on the floor behind and straw in here so if they fall they'll bounce you're right you're right Oh, you do need to lift your head up a bit there, boo, don't you? Well, you're going to hear us Meg, not me now. <laughs> <laughs>
What are your leg straps doing? Oh, yeah, I've got to do this back up. Really like right, I'm going to stop vlogging because it's going to be exactly the same as what she's doing. <laughs> I'll show you the Airbnb. I know you booked it. She's going to get there first. <laughs> but yes, thank you, Simon, for a good session. Beat you to it, sorry. <laughs> she's closer to him. We're all going to the Airbnb, so we'll have a little proper debrief when we get there. Settings. Hey! Yay! Change it. Oh, cheers, wait. guys. Cheers. Cheers. Jordan. Wait a minute. I've got one. Beat the settings are working. It's what are you on? ISO 10,000. Oh, yeah. ISO 10,000. Oh my god, amazing. 12, it's doing it automatically, Pete. I didn't ask it to do that. Chin, chin. Hey, Maggie, ching ching to a good day. Oh my gosh, we've got to do an Airbnb tour. No, we haven't. You can do that. I'll just, I'll just do it. Thank you, Simon. Up. up the top on the left. We've had a fabulous day. <laughs> Lots more fun to come. And look at the Miraville. Oh, yes. No, do, no, do, do that TikTok that you told me that you saw. <laughs> oh, yeah. it, can we, I don't want to be part of this. Have you seen it, guys? There's this there's yeah. TikTok or video. It's video online. It's a little, it's a little puppy, and it's like a dancing studio, and there are mirrors, and the puppy's going, "Oh my god, oh my god, busy me." <laughs> if you go all the way left, you might see a busy me again. Yeah. Brilliant. Well, what good use of mirrors yeah, in the Airbnb. Yeah, I massively embarrassed myself. Ching ching to that. Have some supper. We're going to go and have supper. We're Thank you very much tomorrow. for day four to two days. Oh, Meg wants to have the cakes later too. But <gasps> One's gone. Cheers to today's training. One cake's to, gone. To, to, oh. <laughs> Was that you? Who's had the cake? <laughs> it was Pete, so that's okay. Well, this is Pete the kitchen. Can do, basically, Pete can do whatever he likes. So Pete funny. eats. Pete eats cake. Pete, is it Pete eats? Pete, Pete eats, Pete's Pete. eats cake. <laughs> Cheers to that. Right, we're going to end. Guys. We're going to end this today's lovely jumping session on my fresh pony. Yeah, he was very what, excited. What, what's he? the top bit of advice you can give me from today? Uh, let's go and have fun tomorrow. <laughs> You have a gallop. Are you bringing your hat? Oh, um, are yeah, you, we've kind of are you bringing your hat and body protection? We've been delivered. Oh, I, I can do that. But I don't think that's a very good idea. Okay. I think you can do it. Um, we've been delivered not very much food. We've ordered. What did we order, Thai? And it's. Um, and, um, where's the door? Oh, no. Oh, we've got more. Thank you. Basically, they delivered the starters and now. Ching, ching, Meg. How crazy is that? Why has that come separately? Well, they want you to eat the starters first in the first well, we 10 minutes. Because I'm so worried about where the rest of the food was. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so now we're going to eat the mains. I'm going to end this video. Can we just get another drop? Yeah, we've got another drop. Basically, we should have eaten the starters by now. Oh my gosh, I won! Happy badminton, babe. Do we need eggs? <laughs> guys, we need... Ooh, ching, ching. Don't demonetize my channel by swearing, guys. Um, <laughs> She wants plates. Over and out from me until tomorrow's video. Where we're going to veil view to have fun, aren't we, Meg? We're going to have a lot of fun. If we we don't, she's like, let me if just... don't cry. We're not going to cry anymore. We don't do crying. <laughs> no, we're going to have a lovely time. But over and out, hope you enjoyed today's video. Not going to lie. In an ideal world, I would rather my pony was a bit calmer, but you can never knock his exuberance and zest for life. So I'm not gonna knock it. I just need to learn how to channel it better. It's like gonna go and eat my food. Thanks for watching. Yours was here. That would be a Maggie camera. She's right. gonna go and do her outro okay. too now. Look at this. <laughs> and I think you can report on a bit more positive session than me. Yours was really good. <laughs> Yeah, but that's fine. We'd rather we love zest for life. It's a bit like being in the forest. Exactly. <laughs> I think the 48 hours at Meg's in the stable maybe just blew his brain a little bit. He had a little bit too much pent up energy, which we are going to get rid of tomorrow. Going cross country. Yeah, he got very excited. He got very excited. He, and he can be excited tomorrow. We'll have a bit more space, won't we? A bit more space tomorrow to get rid of that yeah, energy. Yeah, exactly. So we can have a good gallop. We can have a good gallop for the first time this year. So yeah, stay tuned. Watch the next video and you will be able to enjoy Simon. Oh, we did cross-country schooling at Launceston. We did. That was fun. Simon, you came in to get cutlery and you I did, yeah, sorry. Pete's eats is hungry. Pete's getting hungry. <laughs>
<laughs> and we need catch up right over and out stay tuned for the next video and thank you very much for watching and we will see you all uh, at no bowls. in Meg's got dessert <laughs> The next instalment of training at Field Farm with Simon Grieve. No, a little bowl. Cha-ching. <laughs> He's putting his dinner in that. Cha-ching. Cha-chow. Bye.